wouldn't mind chatting with Fisk. See what he knows about all this. But I kind of have a feeling he's not the most approachable guy in the world. And none of it matters if I can't get inside. Wait, I think I've got it. With that fundraiser's level of security, I can't use my press pass to bluff my way in. Unless I'm really supposed to be there. But a photographer needs a reporter. And I bet I know one who's already planning to go. Oh, Whitney! Uh, thanks again for using me on this. Hey, I get it. College is expensive. You want to make easy money taking boring pictures of wrinkly rich people? Go nuts! But you should probably stay away from me. Let me guess, you've got some pointed questions about the task force? Among other things. I give it ten minutes before I get kicked out. <laughs> hey, Harry! <laughs> Pete! <laughs> oh, man. I, I know we haven't seen each other much since we were kids, but... This doesn't seem like your kind of scene. Society pages. I'm a part-time photographer for the Bugle. Smile. Great. Got it. Thanks. Hey, I gotta ask. Why Fisk? I hear some pretty shady rumors about him. He's the only one rich enough who is willing to work with me. I've got, I've got a lot on my plate. I can't waste time worrying about people attacking Oscorp and our public image could use a boost. I'll tell you this though, the rumors are true. Fisk is definitely into some illegal stuff, but good luck proving it. Whitney Chang says the cops on the task force are crooked too. I just supply the tech. Fisk handpicked the men, but the police chief cleared them all. The chief's desperate to stop the crime wave. He's not gonna argue with the guy who's helping him do that. Well, one thing's for sure. The task force is getting results, and no one likes to mess with success. Huh. Fisk is putting a pretty big target on his back. Why do you think he does it? He grew up in Hell's Kitchen. Lots of crime, gangs. Huh. I think this is his way of taking control, hmm. standing up to the guys who bullied him when he was a kid. But knowing Fisk, he's also got a plan in place to profit from it. Hmm. Drinks, gentlemen. Take, take. take, 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 take. Whoops. Sorry. Uh, uh, you know, don't worry about it. I gotta go anyways. I've got uh, important things to do. Me too. Something fishy about that guy. I better follow him. Who can resist that? to get into my work clothes. No doorbell. Guess I better get creative. Please, 
What do you want? From you, nothing. We just need your waiter uniforms, so we can serve Fisk a special recipe. What are you gonna do with us? <laughs> Depends how much you bother. They're so cute when they're asleep. Thank you. I was so scared. This is why they call me amazing. Thanks for liberating me. Smashing. Thank you indeed. That's what I'm talking about. Open sesame. Okay, that didn't work. On to plan B. So easily, Spider! I learned a valuable lesson today. Kicking bad guys in the face is fun! No one gets left out when I use the seismic blast. was wrong. Come, Spider-Man. Let's see what you can do. This is whatever... You are just a little man. I will crush you. Could be worse. Today, you die. Say some fun bad guy things like curse you, Spider Man. I love that one. <laughs> this will shake you up. Okay, I'm sorry, and <laughs> that was corny. That was fun. Let's do it again. Well, I saved Fisk from the Russians. Now to find out if I have to save anyone else from him. These people are movers and shakers. I can learn a lot just by listening in. So, uh, this is gonna sound like a bad pickup line, but you seem really familiar. Have we met? Judging from your bargain basement suit, I doubt we move in the same circles. Oh, I get it. Born with a silver spoon in your mouth. Huh? <laughs> Hardly. For me, silver's an acquired oh, taste. Uh, well, uh, I'm here for the Daily Bugle, so, uh, 
You know anything interesting about Fisk? I know he hangs out with rich older men, and you're scaring him off. So I'll have to say goodbye. <laughs> Look me up when you move out of your mom's basement. I don't live with my mom. <laughs> I live with my aunt. Well, nice meeting you. Um, my name's Peter. <laughs> As if you care. I'm Felicia. <sighs> Wait, what? Well, he knows how to make an entrance. Blotting out the sun. Time to talk to the big man himself. Hey, back off! Uh, should I tell Whitney Chang he has no comment on the Russian mobsters tied up downstairs? It's all right. I like this young man's boldness. He mustn't reveal that to anyone. It would play into the criminal's hands. They want to make people afraid to support my anti-crime efforts. But if no one knows what they did, they'll get away with it. And try again. Oh, I assure you. They will not get away with it. Meaning what, exactly? <laughs> well, the, the task force will get them, of course. <laughs> We've been gathering intelligence on this organization for some time. But no one's been able to stop them yet. Not the police, not Spider-Man. Don't say that name to me! Spider-Man. He fancies himself a hero. But he's let crime run rampant. The police are bound by the laws of probable cause. Spider-Man is not. If he hasn't stopped this scum by now, he's either incompetent... ...or he simply doesn't care. Gathering intelligence, huh? Find out anything interesting? The Russians are clever. They operate in cells, each knowing very little about the others. <laughs> when one group is taken down, it rarely leads to further arrests. But someone's got to be calling the shots. Well, they do have a central base of operations, but very few know where it is. Finding it will be another matter entirely. <laughs> How about this carnage killer? Is the task force chasing him? We are interested in catching anyone who commits a crime. But it's a lot harder to find one man than an entire gang of them. And I bet the fact he's killing guys you don't like doesn't exactly bother you. I do not condone murder, of course. But am I shedding tears for his victims? <laughs> no, I am not. What's your beef with Spider-Man? Seems like you're after the same thing. If Spider-Man is going to operate outside the law, one would think he can accomplish things more... expediently. But he contents himself with apprehending purse snatchers. He's a dilettante. A thrill-seeker. Worse than useless. Still, he does seem popular with children. In fact, I recently secured his likeness rights. <laughs> you what? It's this very war that will be the end of the gangs. The more they escalate, the harder it becomes for them to hide. Wait, are you saying the Russians are still smuggling guns into the city? Don't put words in my mouth, young man. I'm just the backer. I leave the crime fighting to train professionals. Now, excuse me. I have funds to raise. Uh, yeah, I've got, uh, important things to do, too. Yeah. <laughs>
That map I found showed a lot of Russian mob activity around a trucking company. Seems like the perfect cover for bringing weapons into the city. Today only. Order a truckload of weapons, get one Spider-Man at no extra charge. Before those task force idiots see us. Relax. We set a car on fire ten blocks away. They're distracted by that. I haven't done this kind of heavy lifting in years. Ugh, me neither. But there's a reason we've lasted this long. Not many of our soldiers even know about this place. Yeah, here. I guess everyone's a big shot. Is it true what they say about the killer? Is he one of the cross species? I heard he is just a man. If that's true... The Ripper was just a man. I am telling you, there is something demonic about anyone who could do that to a human being. My lucky day! <clears throat> I lost three men to that carnage killer. If someone doesn't get him soon... <clears throat> Patience, Misha. I hear we are making progress. <clears throat> Fight. Ah, never mind. Let's fight. <laughs> Who can resist that?
on to me! You are all flesh and no substance! We've got him! <laughs> That's the kind of heavy artillery you see in a combat zone. I can't let it hit the streets. Guys shouldn't have nice weapons. They'll leave them out where anything could happen. Okay, we'll die. When you put forth this weak an effort, I kind of feel like you don't. No, bitch. Now you must fight. Oh, you are just a little man. I will crush you. Some days you just got it. Here, everyone to me. It is different fighting man to man, huh? You are all flesh and no substance. What good is climbing walls now? Now we'll see who is stronger. They say bad guys don't think <coughs> it is different. Fighting man to man. <coughs> no more tricks. Now you. <coughs> A seismic blast, really. Down, two to go.
We've got him! tell you you could be anything you want? Cause she was wrong. Spider slam! I'm still experimenting with the catchphrases. What do you think? So much for fires being romantic. And me without my marshmallows. What is that? This one time I fought somebody who was a real loser, and they were still better than you. Oh, snap! If you were awake, you'd be impressed. <laughs> and the judges give Spidey a perfect score! Okay, the judges are just in my head, but still. This weak in effort? I kind of feel like you don't respect me. I webbed your nostrils open so you won't snore. No need to thank me. <laughs> hey, pay attention! I'm not gonna do this again for your benefit. I'm still waiting for a challenge. <laughs> not gonna happen. No way. I will make you bleed. <laughs> me once. Did you just expect me to stand there? Do you disappoint women often? Can you at least say some fun bad guy things like, curse you, Spider-Man! I love that one. Are you even trying? Wishing they'd paid for that. I'm telling you, he's right where we left him. Your men are panicking like children. I believe you. Just show me so I can tell them I saw it with my own eyes. Better yet, take a picture with your phone. You can show them yourself. 
We've bitten him senseless. <laughs> I keep telling you, I'm not who you think I sell advertising. Then why did someone break in here to save you, huh? I don't know what you're talking about. Makes sense now, eh? <laughs> A weakling like you could never kill our men alone. <laughs> Tell us who you're working with. Talk! Uh, uh, nobody. Oh, please. Please, nobody. Uh. That guy's no killer. Slowly? Is this like some sort of mind thing? What good is climbing walls now? Spider-Man! I knew it! He's working with a killer! They're all flesh and no substance! It's different fighting man to man, huh? No more tricks. Now you must fight. What good is that? I feel bad? You're not... You're not... All right, you're not good. This is why they call me amazing. If I was working with the Carnage Killer, you'd be dead right now. Be glad you were wrong. These guys seem to think you killed a bunch of their friends. It's not true. It's not true. I, I was going to my car, and I saw someone attack one of these Russian guys. He's the killer, not me. How'd you end up here? I, I yelled. Then the killer ran. I went to see if I could help the victim. Then his friends showed up. My hands were bloody. But they wouldn't believe that I didn't do it. This man you say was the real killer. What does he look like? White. Uh, red hair, skinny, wild eyes, the strength of a madman, not the kind of madman I work with. Your license says you live in Jersey. If you can prove you weren't in the city when the Carnage Killer struck, I'll let you go. No problem. I was in San Diego all last week, at a convention. That's the ambulance I called. You'll be okay now. Craven, I've got a description of the Carnage Killer. Excellent. I've used the map you provided to identify his hunting grounds. You think he'll be out tonight? A true predator never stops the hunt, my friend. Meet me at the location I am sending you. <sighs> now that's fun! Funny how when crime's up, it's my fault. And when it's down, everyone forgets I exist.
It's him! Wait. You can only truly know your prey by watching him stalk his own. Oh, please, dude. I didn't have anything to do with that drive-by. I was just a wheelman. Wheelman? <laughs> Who saw all those people die? Yeah. Oh, you admit it? Good. Now you're going to tell me all about it. Then, you're going to give me answers. <laughs> the spider. I'm a big fan of the look. But your execution? Boring. You know, real spiders liquefy their prey from the inside. You should think about it. And you're the carnage killer. Why'd you do it? I get having a grudge against criminals, but... Not criminals. Killers. No one knows death better. What do they see when they feel her cold arms wrap around them? What special insights do they have? <laughs> There's so much to learn. You're crazy. And you're welcome. For what? Doing what you want to, but can't. I... I don't know what you're talking about. I'll show you. I could teach you how to be a real predator. The spider you're just pretending to be. Take off your mask, Spider-Man. I need to see your eyes when you die. Now I'm on to you. I'll carve you like a turkey. I know the truth. In your darkest moments, you wish you were strong enough to be like me. Admit it. Give in to it. Let's not fight. Ah, never mind. Let's fight. That's it. Go ahead. Kill me. You know you want to. No, I don't kill. <laughs> I told him you'd never be like me. <laughs> Thanks for the help. You chose to disregard my advice. So, I assumed you preferred to handle matters yourself. What was that, anyway? You expected me to just stand there and watch him kill that guy? Or stop him. Permanently. I am trying to unleash the killer instinct in you, boy. The one you try so hard to deny. That's not who I am. And it's not who I want to be. Ever. Then... There will always be a greater predator than you. I guess we'll find out. <laughs> Thanks for the smooth ride. I sincerely hope I can return the courtesy by slaughtering you quickly and with minimal agony. Good day, Mr. Cassidy. My name is Donald Mencken. I want to assure you that you are a most valued guest here at Ravencroft. We're going to learn a lot from you. And I'll learn a lot from you. Answers you don't even know you have. <laughs> Eager. I like that. Well then, let's get started, shall we?